What you are about to watch is the body cam footage from Sergeant Catherine Kirkland, who was one of the two officers involved in the incident on April 1, 2024, in Somerville. As a warning, the following video contains graphic images that may be disturbing to some viewers. This video is not suitable for children. On that day, Somerville police officers were patrolling due to complaints about individuals loitering and selling palmetto roses, blocking business entrances. From January 1, 2023 through the present day, the Somerville Police Department has responded to 1,486 calls originating from the Walmart location. 443 of those calls occurred just within this year, 2024 alone. Officers asked two subjects selling roses in front of Walmart to move along using their vehicle's PA system. When the two refused, officers exited their vehicle. One subject refused to identify himself and was confrontational with officers as customers tried entering exiting Walmart. As officers attempted detaining the uncooperative subject for not identifying himself, he resisted by curling his arm, pushing an officer into a wall. During the struggle, the second officer secured one handcuff. The subject then struck a female officer in the face with a closed fist. She unholstered her taser and gave loud commands. The subject went to the ground and officers secured him in handcuffs. The juvenile was charged with assaulting an officer and released to his parent. The other subject was trespassing at Walmart. The female officer was treated by EMS. The department is reviewing the incident to ensure proper protocols were followed, while remaining committed to professionalism, public safety, open communication, and community trust. Dude, what is 
That's your problem. And this is stupid. Just trying to talk to you. Hey, you're a How are you? Okay. We're at the uh, regular entrance, not the grocery one. We're just inside the doors. Thirteen. You punched me. They're inside the door just right there if you want to go see what they need. So we get out with him, and he starts with, like, hey, we need your ID, because we know we're going to want him on trespass. He's only 13, apparently. The Somerville Police Department's internal review remains ongoing as of this video release. However, in order to ensure an impartial investigation, Chief Wright has requested that the South Carolina Law Enforcement Division, SLED, conduct an independent examination of all evidence and circumstances surrounding this case. The Somerville Police Department is committed to upholding the highest standards of accountability and transparency. We will fully cooperate with SLED's investigation to determine if all policies and procedures were properly followed during this encounter.